Hello Year 2! Today we're going to do a modern art activity using some materials from around the house. So today we're going to be looking at a French artist called Henri Matisse. And he was born in 1869 in northern France which is around the time when Queen Victoria was alive. As a young man, he studied law. There he is, there's a picture of him here. And unfortunately, when he was about 22, he fell ill. So to pass the time, he took up painting and he really enjoyed it. And then he decided that actually that was, it, was what he wanted to do instead of working in law. So he became a painter. And here's a picture of him as an old man. There he is there. Now his early work, he used a lot of dark colours um, and some, most of his paintings were very cold looking. But he became influenced by a painter called Cezanne. And then he started to do much brighter paintings, warmer, colourful and more modern looking. When he became an older man, though, he found that it was too difficult to paint. He found he couldn't do it anymore. So he decided to start making collages and he used to cut out pieces of paper and make very large works of art, which sometimes filled a whole wall. Now we're going to be looking at one of his famous collage pieces, which is displayed in the Tate Modern in London. And it's a piece of modern art and it's called the snail. Can you guess why? Well, if you look carefully, you can see the shape of a snail. You can see its shell going all the way around here. You can see his little head poking out here. You can see it walking along the ground or crawling along the ground. And then you can see what looks like it might be a piece of lettuce that it's eating. So we're going to have a go at creating our own collage of the snail. But I want us to link it to our science work that we did last week. So what I want you to do is look around your house and try and find different materials that you could use to make your snail with, not just paper. See if you can find other things as well. To make my snail, I've used some wrapping paper, an old pillowcase and some newspaper, a shopping bag, plastic shopping bag, I've used some card and some kitchen roll tissue and some old material and that's the back of a microwave packet I think, another bit of card, some more wrapping paper, some kitchen foil which I've cut, an old J, well it's a new J cloth actually, it hasn't been used yet, but I haven't actually done anything to it. So there's a J cloth there. I've got a black piece of material that I use for cleaning my glasses with. And I've got a flannel as well that I've used. So have a look around the house, see what things you can find to make your snail with. So you could make a really big one like I've done on the table or you could make a little mini one mm. with coloured paper or felt tips and card and any bits from around the house or you could make a really big one 
using clothes on the floor and shape them with your hands to get the right shapes. Remember to keep checking Matisse's original design to make sure you get the shapes right. So don't forget to ask an adult when you're looking around the house for materials that it's okay to use them. And remember to take a photograph and email it in to the year two email address. I'm really looking forward to seeing all your designs. Bye.